Okay, so every year since like 2017, I've made a video on the YouTube Rewind. It's normally there, a big epic cringe fest that makes for a good, you know, short five minute long video. But this time I'm going to struggle to even get to five minutes. Like if you haven't seen the new YouTube Rewind, it was it was just a Watch Mojo top 10 countdown. Like in the video, they, they didn't actually shoot any of the footage themselves because, you know, normally it's a very high production thing. Like they get people in a studio for a day and they film all these things. Whether you like them or not, you, got, you can't say they're not entertaining because they are. Even if they're absolutely terrible terrible like last year's the youtube rewinds are always an entertaining few minutes but this it was just like one of the many videos you watch on a 3am youtube binge like now if you haven't seen the youtube rewind this year um honestly i i don't even know if it's worth watching it's just kind of dead it's just a top 10 countdown of like oh this is the uh, most viewed video this year this is the most liked video this year i'm guessing they did this because last year it's got uh it, it it wasn't very well liked let's, let's just say that but this time it was just way too safe that it was boring like yeah they succeeded in showing stuff that's relevant and actually acknowledging the biggest and the best like oh well well done but th this isn't youtube rewind like you can't just show up pewdiepie and be like oh he, he, he did well this year and expect everyone to give youtube a round of applause for simply noticing him like, i would have by far preferred 2018 youtube rewind any any day of the week over this with youtube rewind you're supposed to feel something even if it's a feeling of uh disgust like, last year's was so heinous it was entertaining i'm sure everyone will agree with me it, it was funny to watch like i doubt there's a single person on the planet that watched 2018 youtube rewind I wasn't thinking this is funny as hell because it was but this is just it's just so bland It's just it's just they're just throwing up stats. And I didn't see a single Fortnite dance it's, uh, That's what it's all about like, bro, th This is just such a step down from all the years before it's, it's kind of sad Like I pray next year's isn't like this every year Especially considering how quote-unquote bad they've been the last few I look, I look forward to them because they're, ju they're just a funny high production cringe fest And there's very few places you can get that other than YouTube rewinds like last year starred Will Smith who's known for getting his big start on YouTube and it had Casey Neistat shout K-pop. It was so out of touch. It was amazing. Definitely entertaining. But there's no other words for the new one other than dead. Like ge genuinely no production value whatsoever. Like me, a, a pretty terrible editor could probably have figured a way to whip this up in an afternoon. I want to watch it. I didn't actually believe it was YouTube Rewind. I thought it was just like the trailer to YouTube Rewind or maybe a, a little spin-off thing like just showing the stats. But no, it was, it, it was, it was unfortunately legit. I've seen loads of people being like, oh, th they had no choice after last year's. I mean, yeah, they did. They could have made one of the classic YouTube Rewind cringe fests with people who've done bits this year and not making the entire video completely out of touch. Now, you probably noticed I'm not showing any clips like on their own with the backing music or whatever. And that's because my 2018 one got blocked worldwide for a while. I, I don't think it is now, but it was for a while blocked worldwide by a record label. And I can't be asked to have that happen to this video. But anyway, uh, at the time of recording this video, which is about an hour after the video went, live it's already got more uh, dislikes than likes and that's what you get for robbing an easy video of everyone youtube i reckon if it was a big cringe i could have got a video to 10 minutes out of this livid so what can youtube take away from this youtube rewind one be cringe because deep down we all love it even if we don't show it we all absolutely love a bit of cringe right now i'm regretting i ever said anything about the 2018 youtube rewind because i, I just want it back and two let george me just direct the next one i'm really credible and uh, good at making cringe but anyway moving on to another kind of YouTube rewind I've seen today. I, I, I told you I'd struggle for five minutes of just the YouTube rewind. This comes to us from the Metro, which is a UK newspaper. And oh my god, it's so out of touch. And they've done a little thing on YouTube's top 10 UK breakout creators 2019. And if you look at the list, half of them aren't even YouTubers. Like we got Diane Buswell, who's a, a famous dancer, mainstream celebrity, not really a YouTuber. She's got a channel. That don't make you a YouTuber. And we got Jesse Lingard. <laughs> Jesse Lingard. I'm I'm just gonna say this now just because someone posts videos on youtube every now and then and just because they have a channel doesn't make them a youtuber all right then we got noah schnapp who's a, a famous actor who's in stranger things and then my, my favorite out of all of them Katie Wright. Why is she on there? Let's have a look at this breakout YouTube star. All right, she's posted seven videos, started two months ago, and has 72k subs. Now, 72k subs is obviously a lot, but it definitely doesn't put you in the top 10 breakout UK YouTubers. So whoever wrote this list obviously just discovered YouTube about five days ago. Okay, but anyway, guys, uh, I'm going to leave it there for today's video. But before I go, I thought I'd show you guys my improved version of YouTube Rewind 2019. So uh, enjoy. Uh, 
Top 10 most subscribed YouTubers 2019. Number 10, S2W. Number 4, PewDiePie. Number 2, Katie Price. Number 1, me. Top 10 most viewed videos. Number 10, very oddly satisfying videos by Memeuless. Number 5, Yo Mama So Skinny Fortnite by Yo Mama. Number 1, uh, Harry BR Memeuless Diss Track. Uh, a top 10 YouTuber merch. Uh, Memeuless merch. It, all, all 2019 merch on sale. Boxing Day for one day only.